Okay, I know the DLC has been out for like a month now, but this is something I don't think I've actually seen. Hell, I just recently found out about this by complete accident. But as it turns out in the latest GTA Online DLC, and as you'll find out, actually single player as well, because Rockstar, you know, just messed things up and accidentally put these in single player. There are four kind of hidden, kind of secret, maybe kind of rare gun skins you can get four of course four different guns in the game and in this video i'll show you guys how to get them and actually how to save some money if you do end up buying them so if you were wondering this is the loading screen you're supposed to see i don't know about you guys but i have not seen this loading screen yet when i've loaded up into gta online and because of that, I didn't even know these gun skins were even a thing. But that is actually one of the new gun skins right there in the, the picture. But you can see the actual loading screen says, unlock four unique weapon skins by completing security contracts, payphone hits, or Dr. Dre's contract. Imagine the last thing your enemies will see is your admirable work ethic. And this isn't really an or thing. It, it's you have to do all of these things if you want all of the skins. So let's take a look at the actual skins themselves to determine if you even want to go through the effort of doing these things to unlock these gun skins, but you can find them in the ammunition, or I guess if you're at your agency, if you bought the, uh, the, you know, the gun guy up there, you can talk to him. But the four skins we have, the first one is the AP pistol. This is the one you saw in that loading screen. And this one has the record a finish. This one's probably one of the better looking ones in my opinion it looks pretty neat unfortunately you can see it does cost seventy two thousand dollars so quite a bit of money for a little skin but it does look very good the next skin we have is for the micro smg and ignore my game not showing me the micro smg i don't know what went on but it's invisible here is that skin though it's the organics finish now I'm not entirely sure how much this one costs because you can see I don't actually have this one unlocked because I didn't do the requirements for it. But that's the the micro SMG, so that's two guns. The third gun is actually the pump shotgun. Now, unfortunately, I can't show you guys here in sing or in online because you can't have it a Mark II, and you can't put this skin on a Mark II. It has to be the regular pump shotgun. And I'm gonna be honest, I don't think many people are gonna have that regular pump shotgun because the Mark II version is just so much better. But I will show you guys that skin here in a second when we go into single player. And then the final one is actually on the new rifle, the heavy rifle. You can see it is called the Family's Finish. And it's a neat little family weapon skin, not bad. So you can find all four, again, that one's also locked, so I, I don't know the exact price, but you can find all four in the ammunition shop Although if you do end up purchasing them, I would, if you have that gun guy in your agency, go there because you do get a 5% discount, which isn't a lot of money, but you end up saving like five, six, seven thousand dollars $7,000 if you purchase these weapon skins. Now, if you're wondering how to unlock them before we get into single player, this is what was posted. You can see the AP pistol is the easiest one to finish. Well, maybe not the easiest, but it's the one you're most people are going to have because you just got to complete the studio time mission in the contract story missions, which is like one of the first things you do. So if you just do the Dr. Dre storyline, you're going to get the AP pistol skin. The micro SMG one, a little bit different. You have to complete all of the short trip missions. That's the missions with Franklin and Lamar. That's where you're going to need a second player to help you out. You can't do that solo. The pump shotgun, you have to complete 10 security contracts. So pretty easy to do. But again, maybe if you didn't really want that pump shotgun one, I mean, I guess it's not at the end of the world. Like you don't need to do it because it's probably one of the, the worst looking ones out of the bunch. And I guess you can actually see the prices for these other ones here in this post as well. And then the final one, the heavy rifle is simply just completing 10 payphone hits. That one's very easy as well. So these are some very simple things to do, but again, I don't think this was really mentioned anywhere. Maybe like in the awards section, you could probably find how to unlock all this stuff. But up until I did see this on Reddit, which I'll leave a link to the post in the description, I didn't really know these were even a thing. 
Now, what's funny about this is Rockstar kind of messed up because these are actually found in single player. I don't think this was intentional, but look at this. We're, we're in single player. We're here as Trevor. We're going to go into the gun shop, the ammunition, and lo and behold, all the skins are there. The AP pistol has that record A finish. The micro SMG has the organics finish. And then look, this is the bone finish for the pump shotgun. I mean, it looks okay, but when we see it in game, you almost rarely see it when you end up shooting and aiming. Now, unfortunately, you can't see the heavy one in single player because I guess it, I mean, obviously it's a new weapon, so it's not on the board. Even with my mod menus, I couldn't even get it to spawn. So I, I don't know what the heck was going on, but let's take a look at the weapons themselves, at least three of them here. So here is, of course, that AP pistol. This one, you do see a decent bit of it if you're in first person. Obviously, if you're in third person, you're not going to really see them. But first person, this one's got a good gun model to view that new livery. Pretty cool. Here is the shotgun. And like I was saying, it's like half of it's cut off just with the way you, you aim in first person here. So you're not going to really, I mean, I guess you do see it kind of, but... Like I said, the other ones I think are a little better. And then the final one is the that micro SMG. And this one is very vibrant. I, I like the way this one looks, although unfortunately the micro SMG is not like the greatest weapon to have. Maybe if you're a newer player and you don't have all the other Mark II stuff and everything unlocked, this would be cool to use, but uh, it's a cool livery, just not really on a great gun. And then like I said, I, I couldn't get that heavy finisher or the the new gun to spawn so i can't really show you guys that one unfortunately but yeah those are four new weapon skins that rockstar put into the game didn't really advertise too much but if you want to have them and show them off well now you can do that so anyway that's gonna do it for the video thank you guys for watching please drop the video like if you did enjoy subscribe for more gta content and as always i'll see you all in the next one